of your picture have uh, now ensured that they are amongst those with uh, what lasting power in after premiership football. They, of course, will look to build on their start of the season. What kinds of teams to the right of your picture are yet to pick up a win this season and will hope to turn to winning ways. Come out. Really with the ball in search of Shiva Vino, will be kept alive by Talin Chapawiwa out on the far side. Dadane! There's Kashu's touch, he's not an assured one, so it's Maroka. Uh, pick up the pieces, look for width the night, try and get numbers in there. Did he already away to the cross? Chapawiwa, he didn't have a run in pass there. there. Tanwal is getting it in there, it's a good chance! Oh, it's come off the woodwork! Well, he left dead a number of times in this wide position. It also comes off of uh, Chiba Vilo in uh, the uh, Baroka man who knew nothing about the ball coming off the post here, yeah, but this is lovely work. He missed it on the near post beautifully into the uh, part of Kaswani who's in midfield with both these sides looking to have a go. Chiba Vila up against Pakele again. Chiba Vila! Made it. <laughs> <laughs> The problem, Patel, is <laughs> Save me from this calamity. <laughs> what has happened to Chawapiwa? But they haven't created uh, nothing in as far as uh, a side of goal, except for that uh, misclearance uh, by uh, Masina. Now, transfer shot at the edge of the bar! For him to catch you on the far post, but that was hit with some um, power into that near. Ooh. What a beauty. There's time though. Maybe defensively, um, Captain City will ask themselves question on how can he not close a man from that range that quickly. Oh, oh, what a brilliant run. Good combination play. Something that comes from the training field. And here we see Baroka on the attack. Tawabiwa, byline. Three options in there. And the high nascimento of the Brazilian. More than happy to slow down the momentum of Baroka. We still have numbers pushed forward here. Yeah. Read it very early. Lekei, that's good strong play out to that far side. Tawabiwa continues to give uh, Lekei a good run for his money. Early with the ball in then. And Morena's quick. Quick enough to ensure that ball wouldn't reach a man in green. Now, penalty! Yeah, well, you know, it ball, that ball bounced awkwardly. The organization in the box. Let's, let's look at it closely and see what has happened here. Sure, it didn't sure. look much like a penalty. Lovely turn on the near side. The only ball looking for Celino. Couldn't quite protect it. Not strong enough in the end, Celino. Then, Chapiwa. Excellent. You know he attracts attention. Okay. First turn here. Ooh, the reverse pass. Let me right. The chance here for Maroka. We had once again uh, really at it, but that uh, defense bleeding pass was key. To In the midfield, this one here by Baroka. Race on and straight shown here by Chapawiwa. Now, got a penalty, the answers, no. It was a little bit harder. It was not struggling. Ooh. Even if it was given, it would have been outside. Eh? True. The question is, should it have been given? Very well seen action tonight against Utongkati in the uh, Makulong Stadium because he's wearing a pair of gloves. I wonder if that's going to help him with throw-ins as it does with Ryan De Jong. Looking for Chawa Piwa, but uh, his angle was closed down. Now he does go on that angle run, and Chawa Piwa goes wide. Beautiful angle run from the Zimbabwe. Have put on, you put your house on the, on, on, the, on the block to say he would score. He did everything so well, made a great run. Well, a couple of opportunities that have been missed today. 
Was the whole of the ball over the whole of the line. Chava Piwa now. Is he onside himself? Chava Piwa! His legs there and the goal. Look at it again. Ball played on. Yeah, he makes his run. He's onside. Oh, and he's just had a touch. In fact, he did have a touch. Great finish from Chawa Piwa. Look at him here. There's yeah, just that poke. Made it look like it was so easy. But you can see the quality of this man. Looked up and the keeper coming out and he just put it between his feet there. Excellent goal there. For two changes of Lachni and uh, Maduna. Immediately led to Walo looking for opportunities in the second half to put Celtic in front for the first time. Tavlani Tupeni is the player that made way. Shot on target uh, that, that could have won, won them or should have put them ahead, in fact. But they've played the better football this afternoon. Lovely ball to the major. Define the game. It's all a Celtic. And then we see suddenly a, a build up from Amazulu. Ball played through and the major on the end of it. And a great run there. He shows his experience, gets ahead of Shabalala. How Chiefs approach this one. They don't want to take them for granted. They may be under pressure. Chawa Piwa's pace will be affected. The guilty party. Did he get it wrong? Yes, he got it wrong. Bitten to the ball by the pace of this man. Chawa Piwa got to the ball first. Left footed to it. Sitebe. This could be promising here. As Chawa Piwa races into the box. Good ball, yeah! They're saying that believe in that. Look at this ball that was headed back by Cardoso. Look at the numbers. Chiefs had the numbers to deal with this. But again, there was so much ball watching. But you've got to credit Chawa Piwa. But this man, deadly, as he's always been this season. And the goal scorer, of course, for Amazulu. It's an easy tap. But against the man that won the ball earlier on, played it into the midfield. And Amazulu won it and played. Very quick onto the second ball, Amazulu. Crunching challenge, but he rides it. Amazulu now. Could be something on here, just yet for a second into the side. Betty. Teams wanted to get out with it quickly, but the referee's going to send them back. The focus is on a attacking for Chiefs. There's loopholes, there's gaps in the defense. And it is Maduna. He chose, he chose the wrong within reach of the keeper. Oh, that's a mistake. There's problems here. Amazulu now with Matuna. Can he finish this time? And again, it's a poor time. Well, well there's still Watch a this. lot of intrigue in this game. Take a look at what happens here. Comedy Nothing in it. What is it? He runs into the man. And Matuna, just again, a poor touch there. Too heavy. The options that he scored as well. Pressing from Amazulu. Sitebe on the attack. And Thule battling with Phillies and Thule using his strength. Now Chawa Piwa, early ball in again. Decent combination here from Amazulu. Can he square it? Chawa Piwa, that's a brilliantly worked goal. Finished by Ntuli. His skill uh, with swift movements of that nature between Chawa Piwa and Ntuli. Look at how they go on with a one-touch combination up until Chawa Piwa eventually cuts it back into the own running Ntuli who connects well with the header to beat the goalkeeper. It's an excellent, excellent game of football. First of all, it's Nduli how he wins, and then sees the opportunity to combine with Chawa Piwa. <coughs> man, man. Well, there were about four one-twos between the two of them in the build-up. Good chance again for Amazulu. This uh, Zimbabwean Chawa Piwa being a little underutilized. Uh. Could be a chance for Amazulu to fire something in. Gathered comfortably from a Chawa Piwa effort by Mbambo. Yeah, that's where Chawa Piwa can be so dangerous. Coming in off the left hand side to a central. Move. Oh, Temporal. What a corker! Chawa Piwa, what a way to get your first for Amazulu! On! Yeah, it's his second attempt of the game. Titi, in a brilliant strike. Goalkeeper should have got in there a little bit earlier, but Chawa Piwa wasted no time, got the ball out of his feet, and a brilliant strike that sees Amazulu with a bit of life injected into them. Well, it was uh, flying away.